Bienvenidos and welcome to another episode of Spain on a Fork. Today we're making another classic Spanish recipe, this time from the beautiful city of Sevilla, which is located in the region of Andalucía. We're talking pavillas de bacalao. This dish is basically cod fillets that you coat in a delicious beer batter and fry until they're golden and crispy. And finally, you serve them next to a lemon garlic alioli to take things to the next level. Folks, you can serve this dish as a tapas appetizer, like they do in Sevilla, or even as a main course, next to some roasted potatoes. Either way, this recipe is super easy to make, and it's all done in under 30 minutes. All right, let's begin by making the beer batter first. I'm going to add in one cup of all-purpose flour into a large bowl. This is about 120 grams. Then we'll add in one teaspoon of baking powder, which is 4 grams and a quarter teaspoon of sea salt, which is one and a half grams. And we'll whisk the dry ingredients together until they're well mixed. Then we'll make a well in the middle, add in one large egg, and three quarters of a cup of cold beer, which is 180 milliliters. If beer is not your thing, you can substitute it for club soda and we'll whisk everything together until we end up with a creamy batter that has no lumps in it. For the next step, let's start heating our oil. That way once we have our fish ready, this dish will come together in a flash. I'm gonna heat a large fry pan with a medium to medium high heat. On a dial from zero to 10, that would be about a seven. And I'm gonna add in one cup of sunflower oil, which is 240 milliliters. You can use other types of neutral oils here, such as canola, peanut, or even grapeseed oil. In the meantime, I'm going to add in a couple cod fillets over some paper towels and pat them completely dry. The cod I'm using I bought frozen and thawed out used to make things easier and cheaper. Of course, you can also use fresh cod here, as well as any other type of firm white fish. Then we'll season the fillets of cod with sea salt and freshly cracked black pepper. and we'll cut the cod fillets into smaller pieces. If you like, you can leave the fillets whole. However, traditionally, they are cut into smaller handheld pieces that we can easily eat them as a tapas appetizer. Then we'll coat the pieces of cod in some all-purpose flour. And then into the beer batter, making sure that they're fully coated all around. All right, let's move back to the pan. At this point, that oil should be nice and hot. It's been heating between eight to 10 minutes. I'm gonna start adding the pieces of cod into the pan, making sure to shake off any of the excess batter. And if you see that all the pieces don't fit in there at once, make sure to cook this in batches, that way you don't overcrowd the pan. And we're gonna go for two to three minutes per side here, or until the pieces of cod are golden fried all around. Once the pieces of cod are golden fried all around, they should be perfectly cooked through. At this point, I'm going to start removing them from the fry pan and transferring them over a wire rack with some paper towels underneath. And we'll leave our pieces of cod to sit here just for one to two minutes. That way they can settle and slightly cool off. For the final step, let's make the lemon garlic alioli, which literally takes one minute to put together. I'm going to add in half a cup of mayonnaise into a bowl. This is 120 grams. Then we'll finely grate in one clove of garlic. Finely grate the zest of half a lemon, making sure to avoid the white pith as it adds a bitter flavor. One teaspoon of lemon juice, which is five milliliters and one tablespoon of extra virgin olive oil, which is 15 milliliters. Then we'll season with a kiss of sea salt and freshly cracked black pepper. And we'll whisk it together until we end up with a creamy sauce. Then we'll transfer the alioli into a serving dish and then add in the pieces of fried cod. And for the final touch, we'll add in some lemon wedges and some fresh parsley. Check it out, pavillas de bacalao, a beautiful tapas dish from the city of Sevilla. Super easy to make, gorgeous presentation, and all done in under 30 minutes. Let's give it a try and see how it turned out. 
Once again, folks, pavillas de bacalao. Look how delicious these turned out. Here we go. I gotta finish this last bite, come on. They're so good. And that beer batter has such a great flavor. The outside it's light and crispy, and the inside the cod perfectly cooked through, and that lemon garlic alioli taking things to the next level. You saw this so easy to make, very simple ingredients and done in under 30 minutes. Give it a try at home and I promise with that first bite, you're gonna have an instant trip to the beautiful city of Sevilla. Really quick before I go, a uh, shout out to a couple of my patrons, David Houston, Britt Saunders, Tandy Irvin, Debbie Lee, and Maria. And guys, thank you so much for being patrons of Spain on a Fork. You know how much I appreciate you. If you enjoyed today's video, hit that like button as it really helps out the channel. Leave me a comment below. And as always, don't forget to share this video with your family and friends. That way our Spain on a Fork community can continue to grow. Till the next time, hasta luego.